Nagbabalik po ang cure. Matapos nating malaman ang ibig sabihin ng appendicitis at kung ano ang mga simptomas nito, ngayon naman alamin natin kung paano nagkaka-appendicitis ang isang tao at kung saan ito nakukuha. So, Doc, can you explain that? Uh, actually, Del, hindi, it's not, uh, hindi, ano tawag doon, there's no real cause of uh, appendicitis. Eh. Anybody can have it, actually, no? Uh, like I said earlier, it's infection of the appendix. And any uh, infection in the nearby tissue, like the uh, large intestines, can also cause appendicitis. See. Si. Yeah. So, wala talaga ang specific Walang na specific signs cause. or symptoms. Walang specific cause of uh, acute appendicitis. And like I said earlier, it's just the obs anything that would obstruct the lumen of the appendix can cause acute appendicitis. Okay, Doc. So, any question, Doc? Wala po. Okay. No, I have. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, Doc. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> the killer question. Hirapan <laughs> ko. No, uh, in children, because you also have appendicitis in children, um, there are children who have this uh, respiratory tract infection, um, like, for example, a viral infection. Uh, some children, after a few days, they have um, appendicitis, uh, which is the most common uh, because, percentage. Yeah, because uh, any uh, upper respiratory tract infection or any any infection for that matter will cause lymphoid uh, hyperplasia. And since we know that the appendix is a lymphoid organ, it also, um, what do you call this, it, uh, it gets infected, yes, it enlarges also, which could cause the obstruction of the lumen. Uh, the lymphoid, which is the lymphatics, it's the one that um, that, the, the, that causes the obstruction. That causes the obstruction, yes. or the hyperplasia, lymphoid tissue hyper hi, hyperplasia, causes the obstruction of the lumen of the appendix. So actually, it's the lymphoid tissue which filters the blood, the That's blood right. and bacteria, and of bacteria. course. Yes. yes. Yeah. Yung mga buntis ba pwede magka oh, yeah. oh yes, anybody Pero can since malaki yung chan nila, it would be a different, yes, yes, it would be different because uh, as we know that the, the best way to diagnose appendicitis is history and physical examination, which I will discuss later. And any since uh, your uterus is enlarged, uh, yung anatomy of the appendix would not be uh, the same position as a normal uh, person. Hindi dito yung Hindi sakit. dito ang sakit pwede dito because nag enlarge yung tummy ng buntis. Yeah, it will be displaced. It will be displaced. So it's uh, more of a, uh, what do you call this, high index of suspicion na lang. And I, I, like I said, the history and physical examination is the best diagnosis for acute appendicitis. I see. So, ano po ba yung mga risk factors ng appendicitis, Doc? None. none Wala po. None. There's no, there's no risk. Yeah, kahit sino. Kahit sino As pwede talaga. Very even, common in Even yung mga bata po. Uh, actually, the youngest, I think, is 8 years old. Your referral, Dr. Suarez, to me. We had a case 4 years old. Uh, I think uh, 8 was my, was my the earliest, youngest. the youngest uh, I uh, saw. So chances are even yung uh, younger than 8 years old pwede rin po. Yes, yes. Yung yung tanong kanina ni Dr. Ong po, Doc, na pagbuntis nagkakaroon din siya. Wala bang impact yon or wala bang epekto yon sa mga bata inside? Kung hindi magrupture. Kung hindi siya uh, yeah, kung hindi magrupture. Okay. So once na diagnose mo actually yung appendicitis, you have to remove it right away to prevent complications. complications. Yes. So, pwede po ba ikamatay ng mga tao ang appendicitis? Yeah. Uh, actually, acute appendicitis is divided in three portions. No? You have the early acute appendicitis, you have the suppurative type, and you have the uh, rupture of the appendix. Okay? So, at an early stage, like anything else, if you get it early, it can be cured. Less complications, less cost. Secondly, it becomes suppurative, and later on, it will rupture. Once you have appendicitis, it is progressive. Hindi mo na mababago. Okay, so some uh, patients ask me, hindi ba pwede makuha sa gamot or something? I would advise, we would be uh, wasting time. Instead of uh, removing the appendix at an early stage without any complications, uh, would be better. Okay, so we cannot buy time in other words. Once diagnosed.
Okay. okay. So, ganun pala yun. <laughs> no such thing as, bibigyan mo na ng antibiotic, tas i-observe no, ba? No, no. Not even the middle of the night. If you diagnose acute appendicitis at 3 o'clock, 2 o'clock in the morning, you really have to take it out as soon as possible. Because, as we all know, once it ruptures, it becomes, I mean, uh, mor- mortality and morbidity increases. So, you cannot prevent uh, appendicitis? No, no. I don't think so. Ganun, ganun ta- ka talaga siya ka risky. Yes, yes. Okay. So, ayan po mga kaibigan, dyan lang po kayo at magbabalik po ang cure. <laughs> 